Nyquist frequency is basically half of the fastest switching signals of an interface or a baud rate. The Nyquist frequency is the minimum frequency required for resampling of a digital of a of a digital data stream at some uh, data rate, and it's generally uh, for for binary signaling or non-return to zero signaling. It's essentially it's generally one half of the bit rate. Basically, what it says is if you're sampling a continuous system discreetly, you need to be able to sample at half the maximum frequency of the continuous signal in order to reconstruct the message. And so what it is, is it's the minimum frequency required to perfectly reproduce a signal with a set bandwidth. In order to sample that frequency in the digital world, right, for every single hertz, which is a cycle per second, one hertz is one cycle per second, right, we need to sample at least two times, right? Because you can imagine, if we, ha if we sample uh, one time, we are going to miss that frequency because we don't know that it's uh, changing. Let's say you change the coding scheme to something like PAM4. So with that PAM4, you're doubling that double data rate. So now you have 20 gigabit per second on that same Nyquist frequency of five gigahertz. So that sampling rate uh, and how it relates to your frequency of interest, that's Nyquist frequency for us. It is also in interesting and important in signal integrity because the Nyquist frequency shows up also when we do mathematics on a signal, like uh, we take a measured or simulated as parameter data and transform it to a TDR-like data. 